aí pessoal, é, essa semana é a semana que começa o projeto final, então é, tem o, o Ken que vai falar um pouco como foi o projeto dele, como é que ele planejou o, o projeto, são duas semanas, a sétima e a oitava semana, e aí a gente vai falar um pouco em inglês, mas aí o YouTube tem a, tem a tradução aí para vocês. Uh, Ken, beforehand, uh, first of all, I, I glad that you <laughs> that you can record this video with me. Yeah, yeah I think no it will happen the the guys that are interested to do a boot camp like that. So this is Ken, and you can introduce yourself. Hey guys, uh, my name is Ken. I'm a fellow cohort at Lighthouse Labs. Uh, we're not working in the same project, but uh, for my final project. I'm doing uh, this website called uh, Code Class, and uh, basically it uh, helps people learn more how to how to code. Yeah, and how was the uh, the planning? How did you manage what you are gonna do, and how did you manage your team work and tasks? Yeah. Uh, well, we started planning about two weeks ago. Uh, and then we we were pretty good with planning. Uh, we used Google Docs and also uh, Trello, Trello to yeah. manage all of our uh, tasks and everything. Um, we had pretty good communication on Slack, That's good. and uh, that was probably really important uh, sure. for our success. Um, just every step of the way, uh, we had pretty good communication. Um, and then we made sure that we documented everything pretty well, right. all our tasks and what we had to do. Uh, we, we had a lot of lists, like agendas, uh, what we needed to, to do by when, uh, Great. which is why yeah, we, we pretty much got our product out when we wanted to. Uh, just the minimum product was out maybe one day after we planned it to be out. Oh, really? uh, yeah, so, which is fine, yeah. Um, and like do you guys define a like a product owner or a manager i don't know how how did you like there is one person that has the um they have the overview and they like no guide the others? not really like uh yeah like we actually did a pretty good job in uh, just delegating tasks um some people just took over some parts uh, like one of my teammates, she decided to take over deploying the app. Um, I decided to to uh, like kind of create the front end architecture. Um, so that included, you know, just uh, where all the components go. I guess in in the front end uh, for user interactions and everything. Um, another guy decided to take over, you know, most of the styling, just the CSS and stuff. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's that's how we divide our work. So no one was, you know, no one was the the owner or like the one leader. Um, everyone just had like something that they were good at. Oh yeah, that's great. And how? About so guys, uh, Ken is from Japan, yeah. Yeah. But did you born here? Uh, I was actually born in Hong Kong. Oh, I see. Yeah. And did you move here like a uh, long so time ago? Yeah, like uh, twenty something years ago. Yeah. Uh, guys, they did a really good application. Like, I, I will put here the the link that like who is learning coding should you must take a look on this application. <laughs> that is really nice, and I think for teachers as well. Like, yeah, yeah. Someone had like senior dev want to create a class there and I don't know share the the knowledge with the people is really great too. Mm -hmm. for, oh, definitely, yeah. 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 So, thank you, man. Yeah. And no good luck tomorrow. Thank <laughs> <Back> you. <laughs>
Uh, we actually have two representatives from easy out here tonight. Kate and Marby, wave. Who? Yeah. Yes. Go ahead, give them a hand. And uh, yeah, so this was an awesome opportunity for us to partner with someone in the community that, that genuinely had a need. And so now I will turn it over to this group so that they can show off what they know. Hi everyone. Uh, my name is Ayesh Levy. I will repeat because so <laughs> My name is Ayesh Levy. I'm from the beautiful and warm country in Brazil. And I came here uh, because I wanted to swap for the software developing high level because I just work with PLC, so let's go to a new world. <laughs> so hi everyone. My name is Osana and I'm from Slovakia. I'm and I have a background in finance and economics, and I decided to switch for computer science because I really like it. Uh, my name is Nima, and uh, I did biomedical engineering. And I think I can consider myself as a Light Nose Lab graduate now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I prepared my talk, and half of it was about uh, the fact that we had the real time, I uh, mean, real world project, but done already cover that so <laughs> it's gonna be a short talk um, yeah thank, thanks to the guys from ECF we ended up doing a real-world project uh, they um, organize uh, exhibition for high school students who are close to graduate and basically they provide the environment for them to interact with universities and colleges and also they have uh, uh, workshops and seminars to teach them how to apply for jobs or cover subjects such as uh, what industries are hot at the moment. They wanted us to uh, design uh, an interactive and responsive uh, registration app. Basically they wanted to uh, have the attendees choose their subject and what they're interested in and uh, narrow down the exhibitors based on that. And uh, I think that's a very good idea for all the exhibitions, but if you're dealing with teenagers and high school students, it's even more important. You don't want them to get bored, basically. Uh, we also had to provide data for them so they can uh, use the data and uh, improve the future intentions based on that. Uh, I guess it's better to walk you through the, uh, through the